you have completed the header section and are ready to add items in the items section. In this section, you can view or enter the information related to line number, item number, item description, completion date, unit of measurement, and quantity. Click the add row icon. To select an item, click the search icon. The pop-up appears. On the pop-up, select the required item. The description is auto-populated upon selecting the item. Alternatively, if you know the item code, you can enter the code. Note that this item must be present in the master. To enter item specification details, click item specification. The pop-up appears. On the pop-up, click the template code icon. On the pop-up, select a template code. The template code categories are automatically populated. Alternatively, if you know the template code, you can enter the same. Note that this template must be present in the master. Click Item Information. View Item Description shows details about the item as per the item master. Select the date to specify by when the production must be completed for the selected item. Select the unit of measurement from the list. Enter the quantity of item that is required to be produced. You can add more items by adding a row. This completes the item section. You can now post the production order document. Click the Post button. You have now created a production order document against the current stock in the inventory.